for me that's pretty useful. Greetings everyone, this is Stokecraft. It's been a while since you've heard from me, and that is because I was in Florida for a semester abroad. I am back now, and it's time for my favorite video of the year, which is a video on the Holiday Ops boxes. There are two main questions that I want to answer in this video, which is, firstly, is this even worth it? Will you make a profit out of these boxes yet again, like we did last year and the year before that? Also, I want to compare the amount of things that we have gotten this time with the stuff that we've gotten from the previous years, just to get a larger data set, and let's see how those compare. Enough said. Let's open these boxes and see what's going to happen. Whoa! Alright. I didn't expect that. <laughs> That's fine. Thanks, World of Tanks. Cool animation. Just gonna open them one by one, as I used to, like every year. Let's try an animation first. Let's see how this, what this looks like. Ooh. Good meaty one. I don't even have to explain... What you can get in these boxes anymore, I think. There are enough videos on this on the internet. <laughs> so, let's continue. Nice gold value. Really nice. Again, I would like some premium days. That's... For me, that's pretty useful. What? <laughs> Second box? Are you kidding me, Wargaming? Really? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my god. <laughs> That's insane. That's actually insane. No. Enough said. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. <laughs> I've always I've always wanted this tank. Um because of my education nowadays, I don't really have time to play the marathons anymore. So, it's a shame, but that means that I can't get all these free tanks. And I got the tank that I've always wanted. It's basically a Russian Scorpion, right? So, that's pretty freaking cool, but... <laughs> I'm, I'm happy with what I got. Let's just open a few more of these, right? Premium, nice. It's I know it's not the best you can get, but... For me, premium is quite useful. What? Really? Artillery? Really? Did I get an artillery? Are you freaking kidding me? That's the last thing I freaking wanted, man. <laughs> well, I'm not complaining about free tanks, but still. Come on, man. This thing... I, I kind of have to agree with people. This thing just destroys low-tier matchmaking. <laughs> How do we get another tank? Like... Don't you have to be crazy lucky to be able to get these? 21 more to go. <laughs> Let's go, everyone. 21 more of these. Really? Freaking really. What is this? What even is this thing? How am I getting tanks in pretty much every single box right now? This is crazy. This is... Five boxes right now. And I think three out of five have been tanks. With one tier eight. That's crazy. I have to admit, I'm not playing World of Tanks as actively as I used to. Pretty much just a few battles every month or so. But this is crazy, man. I, I don't even know this thing. I'll have to look it up. <laughs> as I said, 20 more to go, right? <laughs> oh, man. You know what I like about this? It's always a lot of fun to compare the data. Oh, we got a style. <laughs> I know a friend of mine who would have been really happy to get this style right now. Because he's got the Yakpanzer E100. You know who you are. <laughs> that's so cool. Yeah, that's really cool. What did it mean, view style? Let's check it out. Oh, hello. Hello. Whew. Would you look at that, man? Oh, I, lo I love the motorcycle, man. And I, I love the, the huge light on top as well. It's crazy. Machine gun. I quite like the paint job as well. Ooh. Pech und Schwefel. Nice. Cool. Cool stuff. Okay, everyone. I'm pretty sure that it's Christmas right now. 
I, I've already gotten way more presents than I ever thought I was going to be able to get. So, yeah, it's crazy stuff. Premium stuff, always nice. I don't know if you can get seven days of premium again this time. But you probably can't, I don't know. I have no idea at all. Oof. That's some meaty credits. Like, I know some people have said that getting credits is actually the most useless thing ever. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh well. It's mo the most useless thing ever, but... To be honest, credits is the stuff I need the most. Ooh, the tier 2. That is pretty cool. That's one I wanted to get. Is that the wield one? Let's check that one out. Yeah, it's the tier 2 wield. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's crazy cool. Oh, I'm definitely gonna be driving this thing around in tier 2. <laughs> okay. It's been... Way above my expectations so far. If you if you don't expect to get any tanks, like if you're not aiming for anything while opening these boxes, these are actually really enjoyable. Like I'm just saying, maybe that's the point that some people are missing when opening these boxes. I'm just saying, like I know there are some bad ones, but I've already gotten way more than I thought I was gonna get. So it's crazy, man. Oh, we got the crew member. Yes. Oh, that's like that's like the Santa Claus of this year, right? That's awesome. It's like the stuff that you want to get in these boxes. So I think we're like halfway now. 750, not too bad. Not too bad. And a premium day? Yeah. Uh, yeah, but, but I, I don't really know how to react to that stuff. <laughs> it's just, you're, you're just getting this, right? Oh, another style. Ooh. Whoa, what the hell is that on top? What, what is this thing on the side here? Is it a branch? It's a branch, right? Why is there a branch on a tank? <laughs> okay, cool, man. I really like these big lights on top and the big machine ports and stuff. Okay, we got 10 more to open. Let's see. Let's see, man. Premium day. Cool, man. It's, it's kind of true, though. Whenever you press this button, it feels like you click... Like a few a few euros away, at least euros in my case, you know. So yeah, well. And the decorations you can get as well. Whoa, is that three times in a row? That's crazy. <laughs> Hundred thousand credits. Not too bad, man. Not too bad. I like I like getting credits, I'm not gonna lie. Three days of premium. Yep. Nice. That's cool, man. That's nice. Three days of premium. I think I got enough days of premium. Okay, four more to go. 500. Oh, 500 gold. Yeah, 500 gold. Yeah. Cool. Again, 500 gold. Let's open another one. Let's open another one, he says. Oh, and another style. Oh, yes, the E100. Finally, I can. It's finally one I can use. <laughs> I don't have the other tier 10s. That's why. Oh, yeah, I really like this one as well. So cool, man. I love all the stuff on the turret. Because, like, the E100 is so big and it just all moves with it, if you know what I mean. Oh, I can apply it. Let's apply it immediately, man. Oh, yes. Oh, it's got a whole platform at the back. That is so cool. I also like the camouflage blanket on around wrapped around the tank. And these, like, track pads on the side. Really cool, man. Small ladder. Oh, you're definitely gonna need a few... Need to climb all the way on top of that thing. Looks beautiful. I'm happy. Alrighty, everyone. We got two more to open. And then that will be it for this year. I'm not spending any more money. <laughs> Let's see. Last two boxes we will be opening. No way. Another tank. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh, that's the that's the Polish one. Or is it the, the French Panther? What is it? How do we get so many freaking tanks? I'm lost for words, man. This is crazy. We got so many tanks. <laughs> Enough stuff to play, so that's that's good, but so many freaking tanks, man. I really like the paint job on this thing. Alright everyone, it's time. The very last box we will be opening in 2020. It is already 2020. So very last box. Very last time I will be clicking the clicking the money button. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on. <laughs> the money button. <laughs> Open box. That's it. This is it. 100,000 credits, 250 gold. Man, I'm happy. I cannot complain in any way, shape, or form. This has been a crazy opening. We got a tier 8 in the second box. 
we got basically pretty much all the other lower tier tanks. I think we didn't get the Sherman Firefly, but that's that's good, man. That's all good. All right. I think it's time to compare the boxes from this year and from last year and the year before that and see how they compare. Before the comparison, I first want to show you what we obtained this year. On the left, you can see a table which summarizes all the obtained items. Each item's individual gold value is displayed. Next to that, the factor. In other words, the amount of times I got a specific item. And in the right-hand column, you can see the total amount of gold, which a specific item got me in this opening. All the gold values are summed to obtain a total. And then the World of Tanks Premium Shop was used to convert the amount of gold to a real money value. Which in total gave us a profit this year of 75 euros and 49 cents. A pretty impressive number, I would say. Just a few things to note here. The Julia Winfield crew member that we got. It was impossible to find her real gold value online. So I basically just assumed that she's a normal 100% crew member. So understand that this means that we underestimate her real gold value. In addition, the real gold value of the unique styles for the tanks that we obtain in this video are pretty much impossible to be able to find online. In the previous Holiday Ops opening videos, I just assumed that these skins were the same as any other tier 10 skin. The problem is, is that Wargaming have made changes to the exterior of tanks and their respective price. When I checked in the World of Tanks client today, I saw that fully equipping your tier 10 tank with skins for all the three map types will cost you 450 gold. This means that the 250 gold price assumption is no longer valid. However, I'm going to keep this 250 gold value as it makes the comparison between the previous years more easy. So this means that this assumption further underestimates the price of the unique styles that we obtained. In the end, this basically means that in reality our profit is probably higher. If we now compare the results from the previous three years, we can see that with respect to amount of gold obtained, this year has been our luckiest year. Take note that this includes all the items, so from regular credits all the way up to the premium vehicles. Also take note that during the year 2019 I opened 11 more boxes compared to 2018 and 2020. Now we are looking at the same comparison, but this time without any of the premium tanks. This again clearly shows a trend that I saw last year. During the years when I got the most premium tanks, i.e. 2018 and 2020, my profit was also mainly regulated by the tanks that I obtained. During the year 2019, I didn't get many premium tanks, but I got my money's worth in other obtained items. Alright everyone, that concludes this loot box opening for 2020. I hope this video was enjoyable for you, or it was useful to you in some way. Before I let you guys go, I just wanted to quickly say that I wish you guys all the best for 2020. I hope it's gonna be a fantastic year for you, and I hope the same for myself, of course. Please leave a like rating, as I did put a lot of time into making this video as usual. And I hope to see you guys very soon in the very next video. Bye, guys.